what's up y'all what's papa locking so we are going to be <laughs> studying and doing my hair okay that's the goal for today we're going to be doing a rise set i'm going to use the orange ones i need to buy some more pink ones i don't know what the problem is what they are i don't know we're going to be using a lot of body today thank you got a brush it's not the one i'll be using though um some hair clips hold on I'm gonna be using this right here. Okay, Moisture Lock by It's Natural. Oh, see, you gotta take your time. You already know, I like to put this um, all over, enough of it all over just to hold me until I get to those sections. And if need be, I'll add more. So it's two or so pumps. Well, most stylists do, which I need to remember, is that they put it over the whole section. And then you don't have to use as much product. If you put it all throughout, you're saving product. It's going to let the product sit in there a little bit. So by the time you get to that, you know, that next section, it's going to be ready. So once again, the way I do it is a two strand twist at the root just a little bit. It gives me a little length, but it also keeps my roots flat. Okay, so we're just going to two strand twist just a little bit. Hold it. I did get a trim. Y'all, one of these days my hair is gonna grow. I mean, as in like, I'm gonna retain some length because <laughs> I keep backtracking. But that's what I like when I have my little breaks with braids because like, I be needing them, y'all. Being in school, having a job, trying to have a life, it's, it's a lot. So I end up pulling on my ends and then like we have to backtrack and I have to cut off a lot, which I don't mind because I do prefer, you know, health over length, but shoot, <laughs> at some point, let's get the length. So, oops. I'm moving kinda, moving kinda fast. Not my front curls, who knows what that look like, but, <laughs> oh, sorry. Two strand twisting it, holding it. And it's going to unravel a little bit. That's just a given. But like I said, just a little length. Not even a little length, honestly. Just a little bit of a stretch at the root so it can be, you know, flat. It can be smooth. I know me when I get towards the front we're wanting all the hair to come forward for the most part so where we are I'm just gonna split this and this will be going to the back
going to sit under the dryer hopefully no more than just an hour and a half really an hour but we'll see we shall see i don't know let me stretch oh y'all just think about it i went from braids to this so i took my hair down last night finished it finished taking it down this morning washed it all this type of stuff and now we're here right now wow yeah We're done. Wow. Got a little studying in. I think my hair is dry. Hold on. That made me feel otherwise. Hold on. I'm kind of thinking about it. We good, we good. Right? Always check, okay? I'm just pulling it all the way off and I ain't ready. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Hmm, okay. And I try to check all sides. So you see with that blow dryer, that hooded dryer that I have, um, the nozzles typically sits in the back. So I try to make sure to rotate the whole bonnet so that now the nozzle is hitting this side and then I rotate it again, hit this side. I don't go all the way into the front because then I gotta move the thing and sit. No. Nah. But I do try to rotate while it dries. It feels dry, which is good. How long was I sitting there? Oh, the side. I don't know. Uh, I was there for about an hour and a half. I wish I could know the exact time. Did I do anything? You know how you be like, did I text somebody? Did I take a picture? Mm, I know I bought some balloons. Okay. I did buy some balloons while I was under the dryer. How much this brand is PR package life, but um, supposed to be their argan oil unite oil. I was wondering if it's gonna be thick I like this. Hmm. Sometimes, too, I'm like, do I want to smell like this? It smells good. It says you can use this on damp hair before using heating tools for moisture, shine, and protection on dry hair. And helps with frizz, so we're gonna see what this does. And that works out because I may or may not stretch this, so put a little something to help protect. Which always do that if you know you're gonna stretch your hair, just put some heat protecting in your hair um, as you're styling it or before you style it, you know. So if you put a leave in conditioner in, add a little bit of heat protecting too. Um, might as well if you're gonna stretch it on out. Yeah, I should say now it's all, you know, separated. Awesome. Ready, begin. Here's our before.
Oh, I can fluff. Probably want to just focus on the top. Yeah, let's just focus on the top. Oh, I went a little deeper. Hold on. <laughs> you know, never mind. We're just going to go in there. talking about this is what we talking about i was gonna put lashes on but i'm kind of late to where i need to be so we're just gonna put some liner on and mascara i do need to clean my face again though mm -hmm. yeah i always clean my face always after doing my hair so let me know if you found this video educating a little entertaining let your girl nobody give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel do my beautiful people crow who go to well and as always as always i thank you for watching and i'll talk to you later Hey. I'm right on. That was enough to me, me right where I'm at. See me from places that I can't go back. Just power some max. Have me in shackles, see he won't change.